One last thing that I want to touch upon isn't pertaining to the canon itself, but more so a mistake in the last entire story video. In that video, we had received the D-Machina trailer at the time, where the visible writing, the accursed one will rise again, could be seen on the staircase in Nactaruntoten. At the time, it seemed pretty obvious to draw parallels to the first one, the original being in creation that later split apart into Dr. Monty and the Shadow Man. We were under the assumption that on Tagda Toten, they rejoined and were thrown into the Dark Aether, and would be the main threat in Black Ops Cold War Zombies. In later intel in this game, we started learning of this entity known as the One, that seemed to infer that the first one was once more. But as it turns out that this was likely an oversight by Treyarch's writers, and they later started calling this entity what we know now as the Forsaken, so that the community would no longer be confused. As to whether the original One will ever be seen again, it's unlikely, and what's more likely is that the Apothecans and Keepers fractured into new entities across the Dark Aether, and that's why we see some creatures that seem to resemble them, although the Keepers and Apothecans are no more. I apologise for this mistake, but it's understandable how the community and I got confused and conflated the accursed one with the first one, and I'm glad that Treg did decide to change the name. I do question why they decided to call it the one initially though, surely they should have realised we would have jumped to this conclusion. Unless it was intentional to just throw us off the trail of Zykov. 